stress can affect your decision making. I have often said, because I believe it wholeheartedly, that we can't make good decisions when we are under a lot of stress. And wouldn't you know, science has proven exactly that. Remember that stress hormone cortisol? Well, Cambridge University did a study a few years ago that proved yet again the stress spurs cortisol, cortisol secretions. If you're stressed, like a normal mammal running from a predator, cortisol helps save your life. But if you're not running from bears and instead have chronic psychological stress, that raises your cortisol levels long term, which increases the risk of stress-related diseases. Cambridge studied male floor traders at the London stock market. Can you guess what made their stress hormone levels rise? Poor trades? No. Losing money? No. The volatile, unstable market did. This made wonderful sense given that the two contributors to psychological stress are lack of control and unpredictable situations. The researchers found these levels distorted the trader's decision making. They saw that sustained stress caused a shrinkage in the frontal cortex of the brain, our decision making center. So what does that have to do with you, you ask, since you don't plan to trade stocks in London? Well, the study also showed how high cortisol levels influenced emotions, understanding, and behavior. I have enough trouble with high emotions, misunderstandings, and misbehaviors. I need to monitor and decrease my stress in order to make better decisions. How about you?